We're back with another mix of the weirdest and wackiest clips of your local Karens and Kevins we found on the internet. So settle on down and get ready to dive in. Karen truly thought she was doing something spectacular when she hands herself in for making a racist comment. She was ready to be proved right, but instead, well, take a look. Follow me in. Come on, let's file the hate crime. Here's the idiot who thought it was okay to call me in. Here's her license plate, and she want to drive to the police station. Let's see what we're going to tell the cops today. I'm sorry. Oh, oh, I'm don't, sorry. No, 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 no. I'm don't sorry. tell I'm me sorry you're sorry. I'm sorry for the looting. I'm sorry for everything. What do you want from me? Why would you call you're me in? Yeah, because, because you want driving. I'm so fed up with all this <laughs> This is her. She lives in South Holland. This is the lady. And we, we, we got cameras today. I can't take this anymore. I'm, I'm trying to move out. I'm, I'm trying to move out. No, she called me an and then she drove right, here she to cry. Me. She passed me. Yeah, out. so that's what we're dealing with. On the with. left. She passed me on the left. Okay. And I can't. That's what we're dealing with. I, I, this is what we're dealing well, with. Well, I witnessed the looting. <laughs> I witnessed the looting. I can't take it anymore. I'm trying to move out. Oh, it's okay to call somebody a nigger because you're tired of looting? Yes, I'm tired of this. Did you hear this? You guys call each other that all the time. I hear that. We've all been bad drivers having to learn to drive, but this Karen doesn't seem to understand that. I'd like to see how long it took her to get her license. Go. Yep. He's a little punk, and I'm going to have a few people come out of their houses because this kid has been causing this problem for the race all the time. I never even drive up the street. I never come up the street. Aren't you back here, back up. Let's go. Hey. Take a video. Take a video. Yeah. Everybody's taking a video. Get away from my son. Noise can be a pain, but when it's something like dogs barking, everyone has to make allowances. But not this Kevin, you won't believe what he does. This Karen's meltdown was all because her food was cold. Complaining to corporate is one thing, but taking it out on a fellow customer, now that's a step too far. Karens are never wrong, even when it comes to road laws. Forget traffic laws, just go by a Karen's judgment, said no one ever. And this clip shows why. Get the f away from me, I'm gonna call the f police on you. Call him, you'll get arrested. Call him. Call him. I didn't touch you. I didn't touch you. Do it. Do it. Karen. You almost hit me and flicked the cigarette at me. So what? Oh, that's a mature, mature. 
Karen, why don't you get in the car and go safely home without hitting anybody else? Karens are always ready to point the blame at anyone other than themselves, even if it means looking pretty racist. This clip is the perfect- I would hate to live next to this Karen, who threatens their neighbor about something they can't control. How would you react? Keep the water off my driveway. There is no water. Are you serious? Yes, there is. No, there's it's not. water. I just yes, sprayed off my mat. Walk down there and you'll see it. It's what? And it ruins your driveway. That's you just I got water on your driveway. Is that going to ruin it? I'm doing it. I can do what I want on my driveway. Oh. It's my property. That's you know, so you run over for your dog. Do you not understand the word trespass? Oh my gosh. Then call the cops, Barb. Oh, I, don't, I don't have to call the cops. There's rat poison in my yard now. Oh, great. So I hope they run over there again. I hope so, too, because now I have that all on recording, and when they do run over there and die, it'll be your fault. Well, I put it there for the rat. But if your dog get into it, it's not my <laughs> You dog. literally just threatened me, and I have it on, like, I have it on I'm recording. You're threatening me. You are threatening me. I have better I'm things to do than deal with this. Just, you need to, I like, you need to leave us alone. alone. Well, yeah, now you're trying to cover your... I don't have time for this. I have better things to do. Please do not speak to us. I have no patience for this. Yeah. I don't go your on your fucking driveway. I have my own fucking driveway to go on, Barb. There's water. I'm oh sorry. my god. I, like, I will literally take the hose and spray it on your driveway. What is, like, what is the big deal? Public transport jobs are probably one of the most stressful jobs you could do. Never mind what happens if you get a Karen like this on your bus. Alright! Stop talking back to me! This is a stressful job! Just get off the bus! I'm having a stressful day! I don't want to hear any back talk! I'm seven minutes down! I'm sick and tired! It's not alright! I'm gonna get written up for it! I'm sick and tired of people criticizing me! You've never done this job before! I know! And you've you never done ours! See, yeah, there you go! Because I'll sit here all day if you want to keep talking back! I'll sit here all day! You're the driver! Someone needs to let this Karen know that her racism is showing, and the lady filming has no problem doing so. Take a look. Because he picked it up, she followed my child, and tell me, told me she, he's not allowed to pick it up. What'd you say? My child picked up a pair of sunglasses, and yeah. she followed him. So basically, as he was walking, she followed him. She left her post to follow him because she picked up, he picked up some glasses. Mm -hmm. He's not allowed to pick that up. Well, if he was going to buy them, he's allowed to pick them up. Right. It, did he grab the glasses? I mean, yeah, he grabbed them, but she said he's not allowed to grab them. And I'm trying to figure out why she can't, he can't grab them. Did you think that he was going to steal them? I thought he was going to You thought oh, what? Know. You thought yeah. what? Never mind. You no, say just it again. Go. Say it again. You thought you what? Know, he I'm was gonna, gonna steal them. You. you just told your employee you thought he was gonna steal them. A six-year-old child. You thought he was gonna steal them. Did he not? Did she not just say that? Please. Did she just say that? She did. Say she that, did just say that. That my six-year-old child was gonna steal them. You literally just said that. No, it's no sorry. He's six years old, so you really thought my child was going to steal a pair of glasses? He is six years old. You literally followed my child. You literally just followed my child because you thought he was going to steal some glasses. Why? Is it because he's black? Is it because he's black? You know. But you literally just told your co-worker you followed him because you thought he was going to steal some glasses? This Karen doesn't care if these guys are just trying to do their job. She's not happy about their truck and someone has to do something about it. No, this is, is this your property right here? Is this your property? Is this your private property? Okay, that is on that side of the street. That's on the exact opposite so, side of the street. So Just call PPA. Call PPA. Here. Let them so, deal with it. So, so you mean then your that I can't pull out here. today or park here? Today? You can park. Yeah. If you want to park here, yeah, I'll move it for you. If you want to park right now, I'll move it right now. Why do you want to work with people? Why do you want to give people a hard time? We're trying to make a living. I'm here all day and I'm trying okay. to make a living. Are you retired or do you work? Uh, excuse me. 
Excuse me? Are you retired or do you work? All right, well, I'm asking you a question. Why? I'm asking if you're retired or if you work. Because if you work, you I'm understand everybody's trying to... I have to be a nurse. Awesome. Right. That's so great. So if your wife or your child would get sick, God That's forbid... That's great. I I, I, I'm glad we have people like you. Yeah, I would I'm be grateful. Your... You should be. Then you should be grateful. A hard time. You're like, giving you us a hard time. A we'll work time. with you, ma'am. If you need to pull in here, I'll move out for you. Okay, no problem. I need you to not beep all day. It's not beeping, not beeping right now. Not have you been drinking? Coffee. <laughs> yes, I've been drinking. I've been drinking a whole lot. Have, have a good day, man. Mm -hmm. That'd be correct, sir, because if he takes his wife and his family there, it'd be a sad thing. Wow. Well, what hospital you work Because for? I would be their nurse. Well, yeah. what hospital are you work at? You're probably a good nurse. You've been doing it for a long time, right? Uh, no, actually, I haven't. I'm brand new. All right. Mm -hmm. well, you must have did a lot of testing. You must be smart. Yeah, you got, like, some zip ties or wires or something, Jesse? What's good? You got some like, zip ties or wires or something? Uh, no, is it tight? Uh, it's bottom it's drawer of this, maybe. We'll deal. Lockdown truly brought out the crazy in people, but this Karen has gone bat shit insane. How does she believe she can say something like that to a total stranger? Go home. I am from here. Look it. Go home. I am here from here. Go home. I don't care about your Facebook or your video. Oh, okay. You're Do you know how many people right can't now? stand you being oh, here? Oh, great. You play games. We don't play games. Oh, what kind of game are you playing? I play games where you get f to death. Oh, okay. Well, great. Let me let me take your uh, card. Let me you put your number anything. plate too. You get away great. from me. So this lady I'm calling the just on made you. a racist comment. I can't believe this. You are going to go to real jail now. Well, great. You, you are. Me, China man? I think you're going. You understand me, China man? You understand me, China man? Respect. Respect. Respect people, Respect. lady. I don't understand your language, China Respect. man. Respect. Lady. Respect. If you have a service dog, I think you're allowed to make decisions such as if it needs to wear a leash or not. This Karen doesn't agree. This is not your yard. It is my yard. This little tiny little area is. is my yard and you are breaking the law. You are breaking the law by not having the dogs on a leash. Actually, he's a service dog. A service dog doesn't have to be on a leash. <laughs> okay. Oh, so they take away my dogs? You idiot. Nothing better to do. You're just an unhappy lady. You have nothing better to do. Okay, look. They take their dog off leash. <laughs> You're such an idiot.